Hi everyone, good evening po. I'm Sophie of the Top Pinoy and tonight we're here sa Fiesta Pinoy for the farewell party of Mr. Ferdinand Flores. He's leaving us very very soon and this is just another emotional moment for the Filipino community as he has been there for almost everyone's community since um, parang two years na. So he has been our advisor for the Philippine Independence Day 2016 and the Bayadhan Festival 2018. So ang dami-dami po niya nagagawa dito sa ating konsulado at ngayon, it's time to say goodbye to us. Nagbabalik din siya sa atin. So andito po tayo ngayon sa Fiesta Pinoy. I would, I would like to call on the main man, Consul Ferdy. Ang kanyang ating Mr. Hosam, Mr. Hosam, can I have you for a while? This is Mr. Hosam of Fiesta Pinoy, and we're just very grateful, sir. You're always there, open arms to give some something back to the Filipino community. He's actually the one who organized this together with the Philippine Consulate of Dubai, right? Yes, and thank you so much. Look at John. He managed to have this beautiful cake. See. You can order cakes from Fiesta Pinoy. They are serving chocolate, ube roll, and you can buy it. You can give it to your friends on um, uh, New Year's Eve. And you don't need to buy anything anymore because it's super set up. Look at the wedding, cake. Everything. Birthday, wedding, everything. You can you can order it here. Because it's set up talaga ng cakes. Nila. So good luck, Fiesta Pinoy. Good so for you. Just uh, words of wisdom. Uh, you've been close friends with Consul for the past few years during his time here in Dubai, right? Yeah. So what was the most, uh, uh, that thing that you will really remember about him? As I said in my thanks to him, yeah. I met Kirby when I had the trouble with the sleeping at home lately. I had the trouble, I met him first time two years ago when I had the trouble with some people of the community. <laughs> Filipino community. Some, yeah. yeah. And he was here standing. I was so surprised about the cost of diplomats who live in the community, so dependent, who was defending me if we get my arrive 100%. And since this is time for me, I knew that this gentleman will reach the sky one day because his honesty, his transparency, and dedication to his community, he has been always, always showing the people the right way to walk. Exactly. That means you want to you be in long term business, you have to be honest and perfect. And this party has been always so honest, so tough with them sometimes, but helpful and honest. Yes. All I wish him is all the best because a friend like him, a brother like him, we rarely find the way they are doing this life. Exactly. So we're, we're, we're sad. very sad that he did, but we're happy that he's going to get better for a year. Yes. And I'm sure he'll come back one day as ambassador or the council in the world. So, and happy because we know that he'll be able to help more people. 100%. 100%. Yes, 100%. And thanks for you, Josie, for everybody who really supported him, Bailey. I saw you through PID and Bailey, how much you supported him, how much you supported him. Yes, thank, thank you so much. much. Thank, thank you so much for always being here for us. It's my duty. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. And of course, and of course, the main man, sir, Mr. Hosam. Mr. Hosam, can I have you for a while? Mr. Now, from Kimpal, it will be your birthday again. So, what are you going to do? Sir, Consul Ferdi, so you're leaving us soon. What are the plans for And you said earlier that Dubai is a special place in your heart. Well, that's a perfect idea. The effort really is to be a responsible with it. Yes, sir, of course. Yes. So, I'd love to come back to Dubai again. 
Someone should shopping call them. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> sir, thank you, thank you very much. And I, I really hope that you have a memorable stay here for two years. And it's a heart na to, puno-puno ng experience mo dito. At puno-puno ng mga taong nagmamahal sa dito sa Dubai. Puno-puno daw ng cholesterol. Ayan, so nakikita ninyo, it's Bobby. Ayan, I wasn't able to get in touch with you earlier sa isang event natin. Now naman, I want to ask you, ano yung pinaka, what you remember nyo kay Kung Kiko? As I said, uh, one thing I admire about Kurdi is his objectivity, mm -hmm. his intellect, and at the same time, he's so witty. He's a working class. He is a working class. And with all due respect to the incoming classes nowadays, he's a tough ass. And he's a tough ass. And also, I will be quite confident that the Mariam and Dad will be performing as well. But uh, yeah, he has raised the level of a performance. I know, and I agree 150%. Thank you very much, Miss Bobby. Thank you so much. Yeah, it's live. Ito yung ating mga guests this time for the farewell dinner for Phil Birdie. And of course, the main man of uh, Philippine Airlines, Mr. Joey, who uh, we're live at the Yes, sir. Mr. Angel, also this time. So they know are the people who have a good type of security. They're going to be here today in the fiesta. We have here as well, Mr. Ronald, Mr. Ron Alvarado, of course. Ang laging kaduit. Kaduit lagi ni Consolo for Eddie sa kantahan. Yan. Thank you very much, everyone here. Laging ka nom-nom ni Consolo for Eddie. At ang big of Filipinos. Be proud of your yes. organization. You are the league yeah. of the league of gentlemen in Dubai. Oh, Dubai. And uh, he's the man. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have to tell more about him? <laughs> and we also have our special guest here. These are the, the queens, the candidates of our Bayanihan Festival. We recently concluded the Bayanihan Festival on no, December 16th. Ayan, so. Hindi na tayo magpapakasad pa, iiwan tayo, pero it's not the end of it. That's what we always tell. So, so for the, the friendship continues. Ayan. So, maraming maraming salamat. So, don't forget to like our page, Tatak Pinoy, sa UAE. Again, I am Rosie.